Hey there, it's Yobo. Day 308 of life according to Yobo. A life with no mess, no stress, doggone it, no be it. Glory to his name. No BS. Mm -hmm. Sure hope that's the way y'all living. Look, just watch these videos. Do exactly what your boo telling you to do. Trust me. Honey, this here works. Trust me on this one. Make sure y'all can see my books all the way. Can you see them? Turn my camera a little bit so you can see my books. There we go. The Life According to Yobo book. Well, day 308. Woo, day 306 and 307 was just a hot mess. But as we close the day 307 message, men, I know y'all take the path to least resistance. I know we're supposed to tell you stuff one time and that's good enough, but I just got to make sure you understand it. You don't give one woman something and then give it to the same woman. I don't care if it's your mama. I don't care if it's your daughter. That's okay if it's your daughter with her. But if it's a daughter that you had prior to the marriage, no. No, no, no. When you got a girlfriend that you date and you got a wife, you can't spend more money on your daughter than you spend it on your girlfriend, your fiance, whatever. That is your daughter you had. That's not her daughter. You can't do that. You got to make sure you're spending the most money on her. Child, we crazy. I'm going to tell you right now, females, we are. We, we, we really, really are. That's just us. So just, just deal with us. Okay, getting back to this food with the two rings. Wife left him. The girlfriend with her silly self, fiance, whatever it was she called herself, she too dumb to realize that the man had a wife. The man, gave, the man gave you the same ring he gave his wife. No, she's so busy trying to walk down the aisle in her long white dress and her veil. See, women, when we want to get married, we don't stop to see the full picture. You know what? I want to know what happened. I'm going to find out what happened to them. When I come back tomorrow, I'm going to tell you what happened to this woman. The second, the wife, the woman number one girlfriend who married this man. Honey. Once he broke up, she went into planning a wedding. And the sooner he got divorced, the sooner she could get to her wedding day. She didn't have no intention of giving up her man or giving up her ring. Even though another woman was wearing the same ring. The last I heard, the man was so distressed. He went to one of my friends looking for consolation. That's how I know about this story. She told him, Lord, I know my grandchildren watch these videos. Oh, Jesus. Okay, listen. If the children are watching the videos, somebody stop it. Okay? Let me count to ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Or listen, little grandbabies. If you're watching the video, Press stop. You know how to stop. Grandmother say stop it. Okay, do what grandmother says. Just stop it. Now go tell your mother, grandmother said to stop the video and give it to your mother, okay? Thank you just so, mm, grandmother loves you. Just sweet. Stop. I said push the stop button. Okay. I think they stopped it. Can I continue? All right. He go to my friend. She worse than Yobo. Honey. She one of them types. Don't go to her unless you want to hear the truth. I mean, you're going to hear the truth, the whole truth, and nothing but the, whoo, the naked truth. He told her his little story. His wife was leaving him. He was trying to figure out a way to get his wife back. <laughs> Meanwhile, this other woman was planning a wedding. He didn't want to marry the woman. My friend told him, she said, you a damn fool, and you deserve everything you got. Come on, give her a round of applause. Woo! <laughs> oh, I swear I'm telling the truth. Well, that's what I mean when I talk about taking the path of least resistance. Now, I know I had to talk about some married men, seeing women, even though they had a wife. The bottom line is I just wanted you to understand some things they do that they will do. Not always, you know, don't even look at it as like that slow down. That's their, don't even look at it that way. It's just what they do. 
men take the path of least resistance, and all you have to do is learn how to take the path of least resistance. Don't put so don't put so much thought and so much time and so much money into a first date. Don't go out spending money buying an outfit. Uh, to go meet a new guy, I just got to look good. Look, whatever you pull out your outfit, just think like them. Think like them. Whatever you wear is going to be new to them. They ain't never seen you before. They never seen the out outfit before. Don't lay on the bed at night trying to think, well, let's see, what should I say? And what should I do? And what, huh, they ain't doing none of that. Here is your proof. They ain't doing none of that. Trust me. They do not. Ooh, I wish I had two cards. Huh. Sure wish I had two cards. No, child. They ain't doing none of that. Okay, when well, y'all come back tomorrow, uh, I'm going to make a phone call and find out what happened to this man. Did he marry that other woman? Lord Jesus. Help us, Lord. Life according to Yobo. Baby, rid your life of mess, stress, BS. Find my videos on YouTube, Facebook, Twitter. Come back tomorrow for day 309 of life, according to Yobo. Bye-bye.